Quantum is the technology and it's all about providing visibility of where that spend is going. Whether that's by service, by country, by department, by tag, however that business needs to slice that data, Quantum provides the visibility. And then secondly, it provides the license and commercial optimization of that spend. That's what Quantum is doing out of the box. The Cloud Investment Management Service is then providing context and providing expert advice over the top so that customers aren't just presented with a set of data, they're actually presented with information that can help make decisions and we can guide them through that process, whether that's just in an advisory capacity or whether it's in a fully managed capacity where actually we're able to make those changes on behalf of the customer and just keep their estate running as commercially optimal as possible. Bytes and the way that, that, that we approach Azure and helping people to manage that, we kind of listen really carefully to the challenges they have, specifically around actually implementing the advice that comes out of these tools because I think broadly all of the tools out there give kind of similar advice and I think that's where we've really evolved what we've done into the actual Sims management of that data and helping them to implement that, uh, execute changes and help people to actually make decisions. When I've gone through the technology with customers, they've taken to it very quickly. It's a very simple interface. It's Power BI, which a lot of customers are very familiar with. And what's really interesting is, you know, you and I might focus on the potential cost optimization piece and the cost management. But actually what's really good is when we go through the demo with customers and they stop me on a very technical screen, that, um, you know, the information about the assets or the information about the number of instances, immediately spotting information which is important to them and which they haven't been able to surface through other means of managing Azure. The actual ease of use for this, once we've kind of got it set up, is, is really cool, right? You're not having to have custom workflows, as in tools with cloud health, and having to maintain this and keep in the pulse. So, although the SIM service for, for larger, more complicated businesses, it's not just the case of we're, we're, we're using it under the SIM service. It can actually deliver kind of immediate value to people, just as the quantum platform is itself. As soon as we plug the technology in, we've got the data that we need. It's all there to be analysed by the cloud consultants. So we can come back pretty quickly um, with a set of recommendations and have that conversation. There's not really any delay. And actually, the ongoing service is just as effective as well. It's, you know, it's about, yes, you can apply those optimizations on day one. Um, but I'm sure you've had the experience with customers who haven't been fully managing this. They've made optimizations on day one come back two months later and it's something of a horror story where a reservation is no longer being used and actually they're massively overpaying um, for, for that use of Azure. Whereas with the service, they can track it constantly. We can keep telling them what's working, what's not working. And it's not just about spotting the new opportunities to save money. It's about making sure that what they've already done is achieving a sensible ROI.